we have to do our best to authenticate. And this doesn't mean people are perfect. This doesn't mean that people don't make mistakes. I'm not tripping off of that. But at least we know that there's a body of work we can point to, thus justifying that we should understand and listen to the message. And I say that now in a world where it's so easy to grab messages that oftentimes the only authentication we give to them is we like what the message says. He is unbeatable. He is unbeatable. This letter is from Paul, chosen by the will of God to be an apostle of Christ Jesus and from our brother Timothy. <clears throat> we are writing to God's holy people in the city of Coloss, who are faithful brothers and sisters in Christ. May God our Father give you grace and peace. But our lived reality should always be connected to community because God speaks to community. And it's your connection to that community that also helps you to authenticate if the message is true. Authenticate authenticity. we're trying to live for God, if we want to be inspired by the message and the practice of Jesus Christ, we have to figure out ways to understand, are we doing it the right way? What would happen if we are doing something in the name of Christ that is completely adverse to Christ? How would we know unless someone was able to come and communicate, I know you have started off in a good direction. Maybe your heart is in the right place, but your practices and your work and your ethic and maybe even some of your thought is misaligned. This is why we come to church over and over again every single week to make sure that we go back to the scriptures so that we can have somebody highlight them so we can now adjust our actions our thoughts to make sure we are rightly following the message. Therefore, now as a trusted community and, and becoming trusted messengers, we got to carry the gospel because people may not be able to hear the truth of Jesus anymore if we're not willing to share that message. Authenticate authenticity. Pray with me. Yeah.